we are currently on our way to Arkansas to pick up a load of steel beams. Going to the same place that I was supposed to load for on Friday. No, it ain't where I was supposed to load Friday, but it's going to the same place that that load was supposed to go. The old man's going to go down and pick up the load that I was supposed to get Friday, and we're beat up there, I'm assuming, tonight. <laughs> uh, those that tune in on the last episode, we did the old fireball kicked me right in the groin again on Friday. We was heading over to get loaded and wasn't building no air pressure. So ended up the uh, purge valve was sticking open because the air dryer filter I'm assuming was full of crap. So it was just seizing up the purge valve. Yeah, it got me to clean that window again. You clean them and clean them and clean them and you just can't ever get them clean. It's probably about time for new windshields, honestly. Uh, long story short, we rebuilt, we rebuilt the air dryer over the weekend. Uh, it's working better. I still need to probably change out the purge valve. I think it's scubered up. Uh, but other than that, the air system's working how it should. The purge valve, uh, it's working, but it's not at the same time. It's exhausting when it should, you know, it should just go and just quit. But it's popping off and it's still exhausting until the air compressor kicks on and then it quits exhausting. And then once it builds pressure, and it pops off again and it continues to exhaust. I don't know what's going on with that, but everything was taken apart and cleaned real good, and we're still getting the same results, so I'm just gonna say it's possibly a faulty purge valve, so. But we're gonna go down and get loaded. Uh, God, that sun is horrible. Uh, we're gonna get loaded, start north. That's about all we can do right at this moment. Well, this was convenient. Uh, when I left out this morning, I was under the assumption that we had a 10 to 11 window time, which is everybody was under the same assumption because that's what the paperwork says. But well, then they called at like 8.30, the broker did, saying, oh, we couldn't get you at 10 o'clock, but we got you at nine o'clock. Well, I'm, left, plan my whole day leaving where I get down here for 10 o'clock appointment. I've still got, uh, I mean, get here about 15 minutes early, but I mean, conveniently, you get it, they give you a one hour window from nine to 10, you know, it's my new window versus 10 to 11 where I thought I was supposed to be, so. Now, that's Monday. Let's, you know, see how the ball rolls today. Good night, we need a break. Need a break. Not breaking things, just a break in general. Of things going sour. We want things to go good for a change. Yeah. Get back on the good roll, you know, not this, you know, having to get kicked in the groin every 15 minutes. You know what I mean, Vern? Well, oh, there's our mighty load. Oh. Crazy. Pull in here for fuel. All the fuel islands were taken up. We got the last one. They were actually double parked. Time I got fuel, one truck left besides me. <laughs> After an all-day excursion, uh, we finally made it up here to Chicago. You hear that? That thing's going to drive me nuts. Sometimes it'll pop right off like it's supposed to. Other times it wants to do that. So. 
Check things out. Trying not to get run over. Uh, halfway decent out. He's got a t shirt on. Bear arms. Got the right to bear arms. Looks all happy so far. Except for that thing up. shingle place pick up shingles going back down to Herky Missouri Herculaneum I used to work in Herculaneum when I was a young man yeah back when I was just a teenager well from my teenage years into my early 20s that's where I worked as a Herculaneum at the lead smelter that's what's wrong with me too much lead <laughs> but uh that's what we get to do tomorrow but for right now I think we're gonna settle for dinner and bed so y'all stay safe out there I know it's another little short video kind of getting back in the mood man you get kicked in the nuts enough times and you kind of kind of lose the uh, I want to you know don't want to so, y'all stay safe out there. God bless you, and wear a cup.